The Biden administration will not send any diplomatic or official representation to the Beijing 2022 Winter Olympics. And Well, I think it's kind of a smokescreen. I think it's a pretext. I think the real reason is the United States is a little bit anxious um, about its role in the world, and I think it's anxious about China's rise. I think putting politics and sports together is not a good thing. And this is a very important thing. And this is a very important thing. And 运动员的一个盛会，这个跟国家政府是没有关系的。我们国家敞开国门，就体现了我们这种大国的意识，是吧？我们欢迎每一位朋友到来。说美国你的官员不愿意来，那不就让大家看到了你的阴险、你的小气吗？觉得不来就不来吧。我们的奥运会也一定会顺利的召开的。呃，因为当时我们也有支援过他们，他们却在关键的冬奥会的时候对我们做出这样的做法。But I think it's not fair. Because of the Olympic Games for everyone, we don't need to introduce politics in the Olympic Games. To be honest, it's not really so much about human rights, and it's more about uh, U.S. hegemony. I think when it comes to international relations, countries should use the Olympics as a platform for peace, as opposed to highlighting our differences. Actually, you say, what is human rights? I think. 人权首先得保证人的生命吧。在这次疫情期间，中国在疫情的防控和管制上做得那么好，对吧？所以他们就是无事生非嘛。美国去说这些人权的东西，我觉得这种。包括这种他们出的政策呀，人权也好，民主也好，都是他们自己去定的，也并没有经过我们所有国家的一个认可。I don't think so. I feel like uh, no matter what happens, the the opening ceremony is probably going to happen no normally. Um, I think no one really watches the Olympics to see the officials. I think it won't have an impact. Because it's a sports event. If you use this pretext to fight, what does it matter? It won't. I never worried about it. We've faced so many problems in the United States. Have we solved them all quickly? 绝对不会，因为我们国家现在已经足够的强大。It's a little bit hypocritical for the United States to use human rights as a way to portray China as being not capable of joining the family of nations.、Um, but the reason they use that is because they feel that you know they are leading in human rights. 啊，因为中国现在强大了，然后其实已经威胁到了某一些国家的实际利益了，啊，那呃肯定是会被他们就是通过各种各样的方面去阻碍我们的发展。这个鞋舒不舒服只有脚知道，那他们成天说这个，他们做的又怎么样呢？美国在叙利亚那方面的动作。大家不也都看在眼里吗？真的尊重人权吗？可能是因为他们的实力现在比我们要强大一些，所以他们觉得自己可以称霸全球了，那就对其他国家进行一个打压。